An update to a story we first reported last night. A Columbus woman arrested after she overdosed on heroin with three of her children in her car. The story caused a lot of outrage on our RTV6 Facebook page. But tonight, the power of addiction and how recovery can give someone their life back. Here's RTV6's Chris Prophet. This is the booking photo of 25-year-old Christina Wilson. The Columbus woman was arrested on Tuesday after she overdosed on heroin in her car and was revived by police who administered Narcan, the overdose antidote drug. In the car with her, three of her children, all under the age of five. The coverage of her arrest caused outrage on social media, with some posts suggesting that she should have been left for dead. My relationships more or less just kind of faded away, my family and stuff. You know, I can't say they turned their back on me. It's more that I turned my back against them because the drug took over. This is Annette French, nearly one year clean after a 10-year drug addiction, including heroin. She entered Fairbanks Recovery Center. A story of her grandchildren best explains how powerful the addiction. I was taking care of those kids. I, I, I had them in my care. I would take them to daycare. You know, or to, to preschool and drop them off. I would take him to dance. I'd take him to, and the whole time I was high with, the, with those kids. From Robin Parsons is chief clinical officer at Fairbanks. There's 23 million people living in recovery. There's as many people living in recovery from addictive disease than there are people suffering. So let's talk about recovery a little bit. Let's talk about the stories of people whose lives have completely changed and are doing great things in this world. One clearly in need of help and another who got that help and her life and family back. <laughs> Chris Prophet, RTV6. Wilson was held at the Bartholomew County Jail following her arrest and her children were placed with a relative. She is out of, out of jail tonight on bond. And be sure to watch Indianapolis this week on Sunday. We sit down for an exclusive talk with the Indiana State Police Superintendent Doug Carter. He shares details on his aggressive new plan to deal with the heroin problem in our state. Indianapolis This Week airs Sunday mornings at 8.30 on RTV6.